Thank you for the scars. I thank you for these scars of anxiety, fear and trepidation, of ignorance, misunderstanding and foolish, misinformed expectation. For the loss of confidence, direction and calling. For the scars of impatience, frustration and constant falling. I thank you for the times of uncertainty, confusion and indecision, leaving me bruised and beaten, broken and bleeding. For the times of grief and loss and the moments of weeping and for the deep disappointment and the nights without sleeping. For it is these scars that have shaped me in the dark of the night that will illuminate as I merge into your new light, to shine into the rising of a new day to come and radiate thanksgiving to God's only begotten and scarred Son. I thank you for the scars. For in my confusion, lack of wisdom and failing common sense, you have been my guide, my forever persistent presence. Through all my fruitless and faithless wandering, you have been my constant, tireless redirecting. For it is these scars that will always remind me that it is your healing power that will restore me. It is your gentle patience that causes me to endure. It was the strength of the was and is and he who has gone before. I thank you for the scars, for they remind me that it is not I who is beautiful and able, but instead it is he, the vulnerable, born in a stable. I am the one found in restriction and limitation, but he is far greater than imagination and expectation. These scars ensure I will never forget that it is in hardship, sacrifice and pain that I have been set free to serve the one who himself was scarred and slain. For his scars and my scars speak of his grace, faithfulness and love and how my fragility has been lifted by the strength of God above.